Hey guys, I'm Jeff, the Homestead Cowboy. Um, I just needed a hat to cover my head and this is what was handy. Got home from the beekeeping um, field trip and went out to milk and the fence is not working. So my guess is it's the temporary fence that I put over there shorting out someplace, but a lot of times the birds will land on the fence and it will, or land on the hot wire and it will um, hit the fence and short out. So I'm just walking around to see if I can figure out where the problem is. the problem see it's the silly birds see what happens is they land on it and then it gets caught underneath the fence here silly me I don't think I uh, turned the fence off so as soon as I touch this it's gonna be back to being electrified I'm trying to see if I can find something over here that I can touch it with without getting electrified um, you know what I'm gonna do Here's, uh, we're gonna grab a piece of grass see if I can time it so go snap and then I can move it when, when it's not electrified. Let's see if that works. Should be fun. Even better, an extra fence post. Fiberglass. So I'll just run this along here. I'm gonna push it out that away. And we're back to good. Now if I had this off, I would probably try to wrap it around there one more time so it didn't have so much play in it but i'm pretty sure it's on right now we're gonna find out when we go over to the uh the box actually you know what let's see if we can see it from here from the other side of the milking part of the... let's turn the camera around see if we can see it so the box is right there and i can't see where the pin is we're gonna have to walk over there. i'm glad i didn't touch it when we were over there because we are back in business so I'm going to turn it off actually, run over there, tighten it up, I'll show you when I'm doing that, and then we'll come back here and make sure you're good. You know what I might do? So that's probably, I could probably move that insulator up, this is where it was. So what I'll try to do is pull it all one direction, see if I can get enough slack, which I can't. So there's not enough slack for me to wrap it around, so that's not going to work. What I think I might do is unwrap it from this one move the insulator up to here and then it won't be so close and that'll have to do okay so what I did was I didn't I couldn't unwrap it because it's so tight um, so I just took this unsnapped it loosened it up and then slid it up to where I needed to so it's good hopefully if a bird lands on it it won't go on there but we'll see anyway that's that for now we're back in business and we're electrified I'll show you when we get over there so if I flip this on so you go click, click, there we go, back up to green. I have to say, I have loved this Parmac Solar Pack 6. Um, not had to mess with it at all. I have not used it for months at a time and then used it and it's been perfectly fine. So very, very happy with this. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. What do you want to say? So, what did we say first? God bless you and your family. And then see you on the next video. Thanks, guys. See you later.